Welcome back, YouTubers. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos. This night has been a very long night. I've just been having dream after dream after dream. And I, I haven't really had any rest. But let me tell you about my dream. It seemed like we were invaded by the enemy. Who, what country it was, I don't even know. But I was in this house, and the house was kind of empty. There wasn't much furniture in the house. It didn't have any curtains. It didn't have any blinds. You could see inside through the window if you just looked inside from the outside. You could you could see everything. And I and I kind of noticed that there were some people outside, some, some men. And there was kind of like a little sofa chair in this room, this bedroom. So I, I threw myself on the floor and I was hiding on, on one side of the sofa chair so that these uh, uh, men that were outside, so that they couldn't see me. So what they, what they did was they, they got this, uh, what it looked like, it looked like this uh, a torch that these uh, firefighters use when they're uh, using control fires, when they're lighting the fires in control. It looked like a canister with some buttons or whatever it was uh, to light fires. And it would shoot a stream of, of fire. And what they did was they uh, 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 lit one of these up and they threw it in the house, in the bedroom where I was, and they ran. And I quickly went in and I picked up this canister because it, it was gonna burn the house down. So now I had uh, um, something to fight back with. So instead of staying in that room, I went to another room like the bathroom or something like that. And then I saw another man come in the house and he went to another bedroom in the front, towards the front of the house. And he was uh, standing up, looking outside the window. And I said to myself, you know what? I'm gonna go and I'm gonna use this torch and I'm gonna burn him. So I go into the bedroom and I go to the left, but he turns to the right and he didn't see me and he heads out the, the house. So he didn't see me. So I said to myself, man, you know, I, I, I can't stay in this room. I better go to another room. So I went back into the room where I, I was originally, it's a bedroom. And I went into the closet and there was clothes in the closet. But I was hiding in there. But I had the torch and the torch was on. But it wasn't uh, on real high, it was kind of low. And then another, the same guy that, that, that threw that, that torch inside, he came into the bedroom. And he started to look outside but he was kind of leaning over the chair. He was leaning over the chair and then he was uh, 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 looking outside. So I quickly get out of the closet and I, I start to light him up in the face. I said, I'm gonna burn his eyes out. And, and, and I started to burn his eyes out, but his face didn't burn, just, just his eyes. His eyes looked like, like cataracts. They, they were white, they were white. And um, and he says, you got me. And he's smiling and he looked like a demon. He looked like a demon and he was smiling at me, but but he couldn't see anymore because I burned his eyes and, and he, he looked scary, very scary. So 
he was telling me, you got me. You got me. And he was smiling and, and he had his eyes like wide open and they were white, white, like, like they were burned or cataract or whatever. And, um, so what I do is I said, you know, I better get out of here. So I go out to the kitchen, which was in the back. And I opened the, I was, I was kind of scared to open the door because I was saying to myself, man, there's more of these guys out here. So what I do is I, I open the door and I look real quick and I got out and I started to run towards the back. And in the back, there was these houses in the back, but but they were pretty far distance between houses because they looked like these uh, houses were on one acre uh, lots. They were big lots. And and so I started running, running and running for dear life. And and there was this one area where they didn't have any fences between the houses. And there was a family outside, and there were some some young men uh, in their 20s. And I said to myself, man, I hope these guys are not on their side. So I, I and I started, and I ran that direction, because that was gonna lead to the other street. And I was, I was running, and I was, I was running, and I was getting kind of close to this family. I, I looked back. And there was this guy that was running super fast. He was running faster than I was, and he was catching up. He was catching up to me, and and as he was getting closer, I was kind of like really scared because I felt like this guy's gonna get me. But then he just passes me up, and I said, "Oh God, he's on my side." And as I as he passed me up, then I stopped. And, and that's where my dream ended. But it kind of seems that we're gonna be invaded by some enemy or something. So if any of you have a, an interpretation of my dream, please help. Shalom.